Let's raise a glass. Eric Swalwell slams Jim Jordan for issuing subpoena on A.G. Garland, while defying January 6 subpoena. T. He recount. Let's raise a glass. It's been about two years, two years this week. May 12th is when Jim Jordan, our chairman, was subpoenaed and asked to comply with his subpoena for high s role, his interaction with the former president, on the January 6th attack of the Capitol. And so we are now 735 days in, it's two years, and this committee has the nerve, this committee has the temerity to seek compliance from the Attorney General. I actually think you should not be able to bring any subpoena of another person I Below are your comments. The Republican voters and the Democratic voters do not care about what members of their own party are doing or getting away with. Let's face it neither side is innocent. But there was a time when certain things just were not allowed, where politicians would lose support for their actions. And now, here, here, and the people stand behind Eric. Good old Jim, never passed a single bill, Jordan. Blue wave coming. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.